see. And that's it for this example, since I only have five codons that I'm doing. Okay, good. What else? Let's go ahead and take a look here at our rubric. TRNA leaves the correct amino acid and goes away. Check. Another TRNA arrives and leaves. Good. So another one's arriving, and that one would be this one. TRNA leaves the correct amino acid and goes away. That would be this one. Amino acids are hooked together to form a chain. We have it here. And these are our peptide bonds here. The final process is called translation. We labeled it here. And the final protein sequence is written out. Okay. In addition, at s in some area of this drawing, I would like for you to show me that you are able to label a tRNA. So here I'm going to go ahead and draw a tRNA. Let's just say CTC would be your anticodon. Go ahead and show me that you understand how to label this. Anticodon, amino acid, and this whole thing would be our tRNA. Okay, wonderful. Let me just double check to ensure that we have everything we need. Good. Wow, that looks great. Okay. Remember the purpose of this. If you ever ask yourself, why are we spending our precious class time um, drawing this? Well, the purpose of this is to kind of visualize the whole protein um, synthesis um, process. Okay. Great. If you have any other questions, please ask your instructor. Other than that, thank you so much for watching.